पाकिस्तान की तरफ से मैं आपको खुश आमदीद कहती हूँ देखते रहिए दिल अपना पाकिस्तान देखते रहिए दिल अपना पाकिस्तान मलिहा गजन के साथ देखते रहिए दिल अपना पाकिस्तान मदीहा गजन के साथ खुश जायका मिठाइया खानी हो या निमको खाना हो चाट समोसे या गोलगप्पे खाने का दिल चारा हो या हलवा पूरी का मूड हो तो आइए पाक पंजाब स्वीट्स और उम्दा मिठाइयों का लुत्फ उठाइए मिठाइया निमको चना पूरी केटरिंग और बहुत कुछ पाक पंजाब स्वीट्स 128 और 96 के कॉर्नर पर पाक पंजाब स्वीट्स दिल अपना पाकिस्तान के साथ इंतजाम अहमद आज यहाँ पे रोहिंग्या फंड रेलिंग के लिए आए हुए हैं और मेरे साथ जिन से मैं जो जो मिनिस्टर हैं यहाँ पे प्रोविशनल मिनिस्टर हैं वेलकम जिन से थैंक यू वेरी मच आज बहुत तो सारे जो व्यूअर्स है उन्होंने सलाम आलैकम वालेकुम सलाम तो अज आप इतने कट्ठे हुए हैं क्योंकि इस की बहुत जरूरत हैगी है जेडे भी आप फंड रेजिंग कर रहे हैं वो उन लोगों की मदद करनी है जेडे इस वक्त बहुत ही डिफिकल्ट सिचुएशन है आप सारे ने टी वी पर पिक्चर भी देखी है बाकी सब कुछ भी देखा है तो जो कहते होंगे इंसान ही है जो इंसान दे काम आवे इस करके इंसानियत खातर अज आप इतने सारे कट्ठे हुए हैं सारे के मूहे बेनती कर दी हाँ भी आप सोल्यूशन चाहिए आ सोल्यूशन लिए जब तक आप सोल्यूशन नहीं मिलता प्लीज सपोर्ट प्लीज सपोर्ट रोहिंग्या कॉज Uh, it's uh, even uh, this fundraising is over, but still uh, that mission is not over till the people uh, have been uh, uh, find their secured uh, life. So we'll urge uh, the world powers to support uh, this cause and uh, act uh, swiftly. You know, uh, human rights. Everybody knows that I'm a real believer that uh, when human rights of one person are compromised, we are all compromised. थैंक यू वेरी मच देखते रहिए दिल अपना पाकिस्तान थैंक यू जी थैंक यू आपको कम्युनिटी के मेम्बरान से मिलवा रहे हैं बिलाल सीमा मेरे साथ हैं बिलाल सीमा वेरी एक्टिव हैं इस फंड रेजिंग में वेलकम बिलाल टू दिल अपना पाकिस्तान थैंक यू सो मच फॉर बीइंग एंड बीइंग अ बिग स्पॉन्सर दिल अपना पाकिस्तान वेरी थैंकफुल फॉर यू गैस फॉर स्प्रेडिंग द वर्ल्ड getting the message out and drawing people towards this important cause. So if uh, we are with um, Ken Hardy, Ken Hardy please uh, give a message to the world and to the Canadian government uh, that uh, what uh, we should be doing to protect the humanity, was, uh, especially in Rohingya people in Burma are being prosecuted. Well, you know, the Rohingya have been discriminated against for a very, very long time. Uh, this is just the latest in a series of incidents that have damaged these people so badly. And the government of Miramar has to be held to account. Our Prime Minister, our government, has been putting pressure on the leaders there and mobilizing forces from around the world to help the Rohingya. One of the things that we're doing especially is to get observers on the ground because so, the outside world is there to see they can't get know, away with this kind you know, of uh, nasty you. deeds. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Keep watching the Lamar Pakistan. Subscribe to our channel. Subscribe to our channel. Our MP and our INC are doing good work. Subscribe. Welcome to the Lamar Pakistan and welcome to this program for Rohingya fundraising. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. 
ਅਸਲਾਮ ਅਲੈਕਮ ਜੀ ਤੇ ਦੱਸੋ ਜੀ ਕਿ ਇਸੇ ਫੰਡ ਦੇ ਵਾਸਤੇ ਆਏ ਹੋ ਕੀ ਪ੍ਰੋਗਰਾਮ ਦੇਣਾ ਚਾਹੁੰਦੇ ਹੋ ਦੁਨੀਆ ਨੂੰ ਕੀ ਕੀ ਕੋਈ ਜ਼ਰੂਰੀ ਹੈਗਾ ਸੋ ਜਦੋਂ ਅਸੀਂ ਕੈਨੇਡਾ ਦੇਸ਼ ਦੀ ਗੱਲ ਕਰਦੇ ਹੈਗੇ ਅਸੀਂ ਕੋਈ ਦੇਸ਼ ਆ ਜਿਹੜਾ ਇਕੁਆਲਿਟੀ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਡਾਇਵਰਸਿਟੀ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਜਸਟਿਸ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਬਲੀਵ ਕਰਦਾ ਹੈਗਾ ਜਦੋਂ ਆਪਾਂ ਦੇਖਦੇ ਹੈਗੇ ਆ ਜੋ ਮਨਮਾਰ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਹੋ ਰਿਹਾ ਹੈ ਕਿ ਮਿਲਟਰੀ ਗਵਰਨਮੈਂਟ ਔਰ ਸਿਵਲ ਗਵਰਨਮੈਂਟ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਹੈ ਐਸ ਵੈਲ ਐਸ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਹੈ ਚੇਂਜਿੰਗ ਦੀ ਚੱਲਿਆ ਹੈ ਉਸ ਦਾ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਬੜਾ ਦੁੱਖ ਹੈਗਾ ਉਸ ਕਰਕੇ ਅੱਜ ਜਿਹੜਾ ਹੈਗਾ ਮੈਂ ਇੱਕ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਸਪੀਕ ਹੋਇਆ ਔਰ ਦੂਸਰਾ ਮੇਰਾ ਇਹ ਮੈਸੇਜ ਹੈਗਾ ਕਿ ਮੈਂ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਲੋਕਾਂ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਜਿਹੜਾ ਹੈ ਇਨ ਸੋਲਿਡਾਰਿਟੀ ਖੜਾ ਹੈਗਾ ਔਰ ਜੋ ਵੀ ਜਤਨ ਅਸੀਂ ਕਰ ਸਕਦੇ ਹੈਗੇ ਆ ਕਿ ਉਹ ਜੈਨੋਸਾਈਡ ਜਿਹੜਾ ਹੈਗਾ ਰੋਕਿਆ ਜਾਵੇ ਤਾਂ ਉਹਦੀ ਅਸੀਂ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਆ ਕੋਈ ਕੋਸ਼ਿਸ਼ ਕਰਦੇ ਹਾਂ ਬਸ ਅਸੀਂ ਉਮੀਦ ਕਰਦੇ ਹਾਂ ਕਿ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਆਪਣਾ ਪਾਰਲੀਮੈਂਟ ਤੇ ਜਾ ਕੇ ਇਹ ਆਵਾਜ਼ ਨੂੰ ਬਹੁਤ ਤੇਜ਼ੀ ਨਾਲ ਉਠਾਓਗੇ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਵੈਰੀ ਮਚ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਵੈਰੀ ਮਚ ਜੀ ਐਂਡ ਨੂੰ ਪਤਾ ਹੈ ਸਾਡੇ ਆਪਣੇ ਪ੍ਰਾਈਮ ਮਿਨਿਸਟਰ ਜਿਹੜੇ ਨੇ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੇ ਆਲਰੇਡੀ ਮਿਨਿਮਮ ਸਰਕਾਰ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਵੀ ਗੱਲਬਾਤ ਕੀਤੀ ਹੈ ਔਰ ਪਾਕਿਸਤਾਨ ਦੇ ਸਾਥ ਇੰਤਖਾਬ ਅਹਿਮਦ ਅਗੇਨ ਮਿਸਟਰ ਗੈਰੀ ਬੈਕ ਦੇ ਸਾਥ ਹੈ ਵੈਲਕਮ ਗੈਰੀ ਬੈਕ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਵੈਰੀ ਮਚ ਵੈਰੀ ਗੁੱਡ ਟੂ ਬੀ ਹੀਰ ਯਾ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਵੈਲਕਮ ਯੂ ਕੈਨ ਟੈਲ ਅਸ ਦ ਦ ਦ ਰੀਜ਼ਨ ਵਾਈ ਵੀ ਆਰ ਹੀਰ ਐਂਡ ਵਾਟ ਇਜ਼ ਦ ਕਾਜ਼ ਹੀਰ ਵਾਟ ਵੀ ਆਰ ਡੂਇੰਗ ਯੈਸ ਐਸ ਯੂ ਨੋ ਆਮ ਦ ਐਮ ਐਲ ਏ ਫਰ ਸੂਰੀ ਗਿਲਫਰਡ ਐਂਡ ਆਈ ਥਿੰਕ ਇਟਸ ਇੰਪੋਰਟੈਂਟ ਦੈਟ ਥਿਸ ਗੈਦਰਿੰਗ ਟੂਨਾਈਟ recognize that the, the people in uh, Myanmar and uh, the uh, troubles that they are in require that we assist them and so tonight is entirely a benefit uh, for the people of Myanmar oh, very good uh, yeah Myanmar is um, after Rwanda and after Bosnia it's, it's a big, it's a big disaster for human humanity and Canada has always stood for the humanity or humanitarian uh, causes so uh, from peacekeeping uh, to to bring the world to a point where they can uh, condemn any kind of uh, human uh, killing or atrocities or you know anything which is uh, um, killing the humanity so yeah you go ahead it is important that we recognize that uh, especially when we uh, live in this part of the world we have so much Uh, that we give much it's important that we recognize as you say the atrocities that happen all around the world and many of the people who will be here tonight uh, have come from areas of the world where they don't enjoy the freedoms they don't enjoy the prosperity that you and I do so i think it's a tremendous opportunity for us who have much to give to those uh, people who are suffering in their time of need thank you very much daud ismail sahab ke saath hu jo ke bcma ke president hai current president hai uh, welcome to the show uh, brother uh, yeah so you are here for the hingia fundraising can you say a few words about it hingia fund ये जो इस्लामिक रिलीफ कर रही है ये बहुत ही उम्दा काम कर रहे हैं ये लोग और ये एक बहुत ही रिप्यूटेबल ऑर्गेनाइजेशन है और हम इस ऑर्गेनाइजेशन के साथ मोदी से काम कर रहे हैं दूसरे दूसरे रिलीफ के लिए और ये पैसा जो हम यहाँ देंगे जितने लोग जो कुछ भी पैसा बटवाया जाता है पेनी के पेनी जाता है एवरी पेनी गोज टू द पीपल हु नीड द मोस्ट Right. Is me administration cost me the paisa nahi jata hai and they have people actually working in the field so we are very confident that the money will go to the people who desperately need it. Uh, yeah beside this uh, sending the money we want to raise our voice uh, on the national level in Canada especially Canadian government is, is aware of this situation and we want to make sure that Canadian government uh should stop uh, in, by any means the atrocity being uh, being uh, happening on the muslims of rohingya yes canadian government i think they are very active in this they we have actually uh, sent a petition to our foreign minister the foreign minister has raised voice in the united nations and canada has got a voice there canada has pressing that justice be done there and they are asking the government of Burma 
to stop this this happening. Okay, with this note to be resolved by the United Nations. That's right. With this note, that the uh, uh, United Nations should act uh, swiftly on this issue, and uh, they should stop uh, the killing of the innocent people. Yes. Thank you very much. Nazreen Dilla from Pakistan. Ke saath uh, Musa Ismail hai. I will ask him a question in English as well. Welcome uh, to our show, and uh, thank you very much. Uh, we are here gathered for the Rohingya fundraising, and you can tell us what we are going to do here today. Inshallah, assalamu alaikum. Uh, the main maqsad, the main purpose, inshallah, is to raise as much money as we can, both here at this function today, and hopefully my appeal goes to all of you brothers who are listening. Whatever money you can, and donate as much as you can, send it directly to Islam Relief Canada, there's other organization called HCI, IDRF, whichever organization you, support, you like, yeah, yeah. please give money. The point is giving, this is the time to give. As you know, our Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam has taught one big message, one big lesson. The more we help the poor, the better it is for you and your Akira and for your family. जो चैरिटी है जो वैसे आपने खिदमत करनी है ह्यूमैनिटी की उसके लिए आप बाहर निकलें और सपोर्ट करें फाइनेंशियली सपोर्ट करें कॉन्टैक्ट माई सेल्फ ब्रदर बिलाल ब्रदर हारून खान वी आर ऑल पार्ट ऑफ दिस टीम ऑर्गेनाइजिंग दिस इन शाला प्लीज हुए वाई यू नो इन दिस ग्रुप फॉलस एंड वी विल टेक यूर मनी गिव यू द रिसीव एंड इन शाला गो टू द राइट पीपल राइट नाउ इन शाह इन शाह देखते रहिए दिल अपना पाकिस्तान السلام علیکم جی میں ہوں افتخار ٹھاکر دیکھتے رہیے دل اپنا پاکستان ملیحہ غزن کے ساتھ دیکھتے رہیے دل اپنا پاکستان آمادین و حضرات دیکھتے رہیے دل اپنا پاکستان ملیحہ غزن کے ساتھ دیکھتے رہیے دل اپنا پاکستان ملیحہ غزن کے ساتھ بہت بہت شکریہ دل پاکستانی ہے
जिला प्रभा पाकिस्तान के साथ इंतजाम है हम सिस्टर फातिमा के साथ हैं सिस्टर फातिमा इज गोइंग टू टेल अबाउट रोहिंग्या फॉर ब्रेडिंग एंड वेलकम टू द शो एंड व्हाट वी आर डूइंग हियर एंड दिस फॉर ब्रेडिंग इज ऑल अबाउट यू कैन टेल थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर हैविंग मी हियर यस थैंक यू फॉर आस्किंग मी सच अ क्वेश्चन माय नेम इज लेट मी इंट्रोड्यूस माय सेल्फ फ्रॉम सिस्टर फातिमा आई रिप्रेजेंट द इंटरनेशनल चैरिटी ऑर्गेनाइजेशन Uh, in BC, Islamic Relief, and uh, of course we're organizing fundraise uh, for uh, Rohingya Muslim people, and it's an emergency uh, appeal, and then uh, we're calling on our community and the people to come and support and help, and that's the least we can do to support these people to alleviate their suffering and their starvation. And uh, Islamic Relief, they are on the ground at the moment in Rohingya, and they are distributing uh, food, uh, personal items, uh, clothing, uh, a lot of uh, a lot of uh, uh, of stuff. There. And uh, a few months ago, we did already uh, uh, another fundraise. I'm invited from Al Jazeera TV, Al Mahdi Hassan, the reporter Mahdi Hassan. And we collected in one night. We collected over uh, 140,000, and uh, to, for the the purpose of purchasing. Uh, health clinic for Rohingya and it's there and it's working and it's still uh, going on and uh, we ask everybody's support and thank you so much for having me. Yeah, no problem. You're welcome, Ladi. Uh, have a look, see what uh, Islamic Relief is doing, and uh, even you guys, anybody, anybody can donate. Anybody can uh, volunteer. And uh, since uh, the cause is humanity, so let's work for humanity. Humanity is very important. This is 2017, and 2017, we need to uh, make sure the world is peaceful and uh, not a few. Uh, uh, a few hundred people cannot drive crazy uh, uh, and they are killing the people. Thank you very much. Uh, you are welcome. Thank you so much. मुसलमान भाई काफ़ी मुसीबत में है और उनकी मदद के लिए बढ़ चढ़ कुछ पैसा है और इतना भाई का शुक्रिया आप भी पूरी तरह पार्टिसिपेट कर रहे हैं मीडिया के जरिए लोगों को इन्फॉर्म कर रहे हैं मोटिवेट कर रहे हैं ये हम सब का फर्ज है कि इसको पूरी तरह शामिल है Islamic Relief is on the ground right now, delivering aid. And it's important that that's why we're here tonight. It's here, we're, gonna, we're enjoying each other's company, we're going to listen, we're going to learn, we're all going to talk, uh, but you're going to learn about this situation. So I'll be talking more as the evening progresses. We'll be having many speakers coming up. But moreover, as you look at, uh, uh, along your tables, there will be pledge sheets. And that's a very important thing for you all to sign the pledge sheets, get your checkbooks out, get your cash out, make your need and your intention to give, to go and help these people. Tax deductible receipts will be issued today by Islamic Relief. So without further ado, another giant of our community. I call her my big sis, the big sister that is here in our community. She's worked tirelessly with many, many communities. And, uh, and she's done tremendous work with the Syrian refugees and on many other aid projects throughout the years. So I would like you all to please, uh, please pay some attention to the words and the message of my dear sister, Fatima Ben Hatem. My brothers and sisters, my good friends, my distinguished guests, peace be upon you all. It's my pleasure to extend a cheerful welcome to you all. Allow me first to introduce myself. 
Um, uh, as you introduced me, Fatima Ben Halka. I forgot that because many people then call me only Sister Fatima. But I forgot my last name actually. <laughs> so I'm um, Sister Fatima. I, um, I do lead uh, Islamic Relief, large global charitable institution in BC. I'm also a community activist member and leader that work along with many Muslim leaders in our Muslim community. I'm sure many of you have made a huge effort to join us tonight. On behalf of all of us, we are deeply appreciative and offer you our most grateful welcome. It is with great honor and great pleasure that I stand here tonight to personally thank each of you individually and repeatedly for coming to support this relevant humanitarian cause and uh, emergency appeal for Rohingya Muslims. You will hear from them, you know, we'll hear straight from them, they will show you their work, what they're doing on the ground. But I will take advantage actually on my minutes and uh, thank my distinguished guests and my Muslim community and uh, mosques, massages, organizations, Islamic organizations, and all of that. Uh, starting with my distinguished guest uh, from the Liberals MP, Mr. Uh, Randy Saran. Uh, Ken Hardy, thank you very much for coming and supporting. From the MLAs, Gary Bak, Rachna Singh. Also our ministers, I'm sure maybe most of them they left. I saw that Genesis, she left. Um, Bruce Ratson, Harry Baines, Jimmy Sims. Member of the UN Peacekeeping Force, our keynote speaker tonight, tonight Mr. Uh, George Summerwell, Mr. Courtney and their family members. Thank you all for accepting our invitation and thank you for coming to support this humanitarian cause and to be in solidarity with the Rohingya. The Muslim population remains a matter of deep concern and dismay for Canadians. These actions are a direct a product to basic human rights and have resulted in extreme violence and the displacement of hundreds of thousands of innocent people. As Canadians and in need as humans, we must stand up against bigotry and hate in any form and our government will continue to condemn these horrific events and call on the government to end the violence. As you gather tonight, I would like to thank you for your kind gift in support of Rohingya refugees in Bangladesh and Myanmar. I believe that this type of generosity truly embodies what it means to be Canadian. Thank you to the organizers of this important event and to all of you and who are in attendance tonight to support this worthwhile cause. Please accept my warmest welcome and best wishes for the successful fundraiser signed uh, Justin Trudeau in Ottawa. And thank you again and Allah Hafiz. I can't tell you what an honor it is to serve with this gentleman. He represents you so well and so much care. I want you to look around. I want you to look at children and know that in the world there are children that are sleeping out in the open without enough food. I want you to look at the sisters and know that in our world there are sisters who don't have husbands who have lost their children. It's enough to break your heart. This is Thanksgiving. And we have a lot to be thankful for. We are blessed to live in this country where our politics, we may differ, every last one of us here tonight is here in kind of a brotherhood and sisterhood to make sure that this country, this community, this province, this city remains a safe place where possibility is what's in our future and not deprivation and harm and hurt. So think about that.
think about those those poor people on the other side of the world who have persecuted for so long. Our Prime Minister has not mince words when it comes to his message to Miramar. Very direct, very blunt. This is unacceptable. What is acceptable is Canadians coming together to help people in need. That's what we do, that's what we're here for tonight. Thank you for that. Another gentleman who serves us all with great distinction and great height is our good friend, Randy Sorrell. Thank you, Ken. Assalamu alaikum. Thank you, Sukh Bilal. Sorry for being a little late. I was coming in the kitchen. Uh, just want to let you know that our, our government takes this serious matter extremely seriously. Uh, I it was the second day in the house when I asked a question on this, and uh, we were uh, comforted with an answer that aid was going immediately to uh, uh, to the refugees, uh, the refugees, uh, whether they're in Bangladesh uh, or inside. Uh, we just received uh, information yesterday that another three and a half million have been added. I think the total is now twelve and a half million in aid that has gone, and we are monitoring it closely. Our government has uh, unabashedly stated that this is an ethnic cleansing. All the signs indicate that, and that we will not tolerate that. Uh, there has been a request on, as, as you all know, that the Prime Minister of Myanmar is a uh, honorary Canadian citizen, that that was reminded to her that the reason she received the Nobel Peace Prize Act and the uh, honorary Canadian citizenship is for her struggle for democracy. If she's not affording that same level of respect and dignity to all the residents and citizens of that country, uh, then uh, that may be in jeopardy and that falls there. So I want to assure you that we are monitoring it very closely. We're very proud of you who are arranging uh, and raising funds and an emergency method to help these brothers and sisters. Uh, and we ask that you all pitch in. This is a humanitarian catastrophe and our government will not make this likely. There will be many signs uh, every step of the way. Thank you. देखते रहिए दिल अपना पाकिस्तान मलीहा गजन के साथ साथियों देखते रहिए दिल अपना पाकिस्तान मलीहा गजन के साथ